Rhythm number 24 is called Boogaloo Do. And this is a fat back boogaloo old school groove. I'm going to show you how to play some triads over it and make the part really a spanking part. So here we go. Let's check it out. Let's break down the boogaloo groove. Uh, key of G, it's just a D, G7, very simple. It goes to a five chord, which is a D7. Uh, what I'm doing here is I'm using some triads over that G bass. So the move is this, the first move. If you bar the fifth fret, fourth, third, and second strings, that's a C triad. And then what I'm going to do is hammer on with my ring finger and my middle finger, I'm gonna hammer on to the seventh and the uh, second string. I'm sorry, seventh fret, fourth string, and sixth fret, second string. So you get this. That is an F triad, still over our G. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that move. And then I'm gonna go to the, uh, back to the, um, the C. And then I'm going to hammer, I'm going to do this move, which is uh, I'm playing um, F, B flat, and D, and I'm going to hammer on that third. So I started out with this G7 voice, like a G7 bar chord. So I'm, I'm doing two down strokes. And I'm striking those top three strings. There's a little ghost note. Then when it goes to the five chord, I'm just sliding up to this nine. There's no root. The root, the third is the root here. D. And I'm just using a 16th note thing. Half step. Half step below. Back to G. So that's that basic progression. You can experiment with, uh, you know, if you want to pick a little closer to the bridge or different pickup selections or uh, whatever, but that's a fun groove to play over. So I uh, hope you have fun with that. <laughs> 